I would say on top of my list, it should be um, profitable growth. Uh, we see that the insurance companies, they had incurred losses on the many of them in the 2017 and 2018 is relatively better year in terms of profitability, but the growth is in some pockets of the, uh, in the, in the region has been slowed down. So when I look at it, the sustainable growth is, is always the top uh, critical uh, matter for the companies operating in the GCC in the entire region. Mm-hmm. Um, having said that, obviously growth it doesn't happen easily. You need to invest the people. Mm-hmm. You need to able to keep the good talents, which is also another challenge in this region. Um, reason being, um, some of the territories in the region, particularly UAE, you see the many expats they live in here, and then transient culture is there. So able to attract the good talents and able to keep them is another challenge. Um, we also see in some part of the market segments hardening, and, uh, and this is uh, this is by fact that some of the market segments in the in the insurance sector due to the global uh, losses has happened, or some of the regional losses happened. Uh, it has withdrawn the capacity. We have recently seen in the DIFC sector in the Lloyds some of the syndicates they have shut down, and we have uh, witnessed that there is also adverse impact. Uh, to the capacity available in the region, some of the placements. So I think uh, for the timing for us, uh, for the 2019, this is also we will also going to see the impact of the market uh, capacity and the decrease of the capacity. Um, this is for the some segments, but we will continue to see the um, um, good capacity, available capacity for some segments. Uh, some of the insurance lines, like medical insurance growing, we see in the uh, market, some countries, some regions, as such like Oman, they are going to uh, pro- uh, bring the new uh, mandatory medical insurance, uh, which is expected to happen in 2019. So that is also the upside.